to tithe or not to tithe? That is the question. Believe it or not, the question of whether or not we should tithe isn't new and has been debated for a very long time. But the answer to this question will absolutely shock you. Tithe comes from the Hebrew word ma'asir, which means a tenth. But what most people don't know is this idea of tithing is seemingly hidden in the New Testament because it is deeply woven within its fabric. Why is it hidden, you ask? Because ma'asir in the Jewish culture is known as the secret formula for becoming rich. This very concept is explicitly taught in the Talmud in Tani 9a. The idea that this is the secret way to get rich is also hidden in the Hebrew word ma'asir itself. Ma in Hebrew means to be or to become, and asir means riches or wealth. Together, ma'asir means to be or become wealthy. So why should we give the tithe? Because tithing is the only way we are allowed to put God to the test. God, I challenge you to do what you said. And it's the secret formula to getting rich. In all seriousness, this is exactly what God says in Malachi 3.10, when he said, bring ye all the types into the storehouse, that there may be meat in mine house, and prove me now herewith, this is to say, Test me, challenge me and see, saith the Lord of hosts, if I will not open you the windows of heaven and pour you out a blessing that there shall not be room enough to receive it. This alone should be more than enough reason for us to type. But let's see what light ancient Hebrew sheds on the word ma'aser, which we call type. Ma'aser is written in Hebrew, mean, ayin, sheen, and resh. Meme is the picture of water, which can mean anything that flows. Ayin is the picture of an eyeball and means to see or experience. And sheen is the picture of two front teeth and it means to press down. Sheen is also the letter God chose to identify himself. And resh is the picture of a man's head, which means head as in the head of something first chief or top. The ancient Hebrew picture of Ma'asir reveals the flow that is seen or experienced in the pressing down of God's first. This is an amazing revelation, a revelation that should remind you of countless biblical truths, things that have already been told to us in the scriptures. Is the type to be set aside first? Yes, it's God's first. Did God say, I will pour you out a blessing? He sure did. That's that flow. Did Jesus say, give, and it will be given unto you? Good measure, pressed down, shaken together, running over. Doesn't that running over sound like more than we have room enough to receive? Does pressed down not re-emphasize the picture of the two front teeth as seen and sheen? Listen. Ideas like these are literally embedded in the entire New Testament, but we must be careful not to overlook them. We have to actively and meticulously look for them. Remember, Ma'asir, tithing, is the not-so-secret formula to becoming rich. And if you want to discover more about the New Testament believer and the tithe, check out my book, Elucidations. And if you've learned anything, uh press that subscribe button.